Hi friends, in this video I am going to giving a simple tutorial about how to make compost using leaves and wasted vegetables at home. Let's we start with the barrel. I am take the suitable barrel for placing the compost. Now I am going to placing the holes in the barrels. The compost is an organic matter that has been decomposed in a process called composting. This process recycles various organic materials otherwise regarded as waste products and produce a soil conditioner. Compost is a rich nutrient. The composting is an aerobic process which means air is vital to ensure effective decomposition. The presence of air in the bin is much more dependent on the structure and the mix of the material in the bin than the presence of air holes. The main reason for placing the holes in this barrel because microbes, worms, snails, insects and fungi decompose organic materials aerobically which means they use oxygen as they break down the materials in the pile. Bacteria are the powerhouse of the compost pile. They break down plant material and create carbon dioxide and heat. Now you place the holes properly with the drill or other machines and also place the holes at the bottom of this bin because of the slurry is producing during this process. You just place about 10 to 12 holes at the bottom of the bin because of the more slurry is producing during this process. Now the compost bin is ready. In the next step we are going to preparing the compost mix. The good thing to compost include vegetable peelings, fruit waste, tea bags, plant pruning and grass cuttings. These are fast to break down and provide imported nitrogen as well as moisture. It is also good to include things such as cardboard, egg box, scrunch up paper and fallen leaves. The important ingredients to work effectively is that need carbon, nitrogen, water and oxygen. The carbon getting from the dried leaves and the nitrogen getting from the green leaves and the oxygen getting through the air holes. In the first step you just place the paper at the bottom of this bin. The dried leaves are the best source of carbon. First one is carbon. The microbial oxidation of carbon produces the heat if include at suggested levels. High carbon materials tend to be brown and dry. And the next ingredient is green leaves and vegetables. The green leaves and vegetables containing rich amount of nitrogen. The nitrogen uses to grow and reproduce more organisms to oxidize the carbon. High nitrogen materials tend to be green and wet. And the next step is to pouring the cow manure solution into the compost. The reason for pouring this cow manure solution is that the cow manure solution that containing the helpful organisms that help in the decomposition process.
after that you just close the compost bin with the lid and prevent the compost bin of direct sunlight and the water keep the compost bin beside the kitchen because it is very easy to handle the compost bin and also i am giving a simple tip to faster the composting process add small amount of compost into this compost bin because the compost containing the helpful microorganism that increasing the speed of the composting after 3 to 4 days you mix the compost thoroughly the mixing helps to increase the air supply through the compost the increased air supply through the compost will increase in the speed of the process i think this video is more helpful to you if any suggestions problems or any errors happened by me please comment in the below box thanks for watching